examples here will be Islamic science uh, and Indian and Chinese science. So three great civilizations, right, which produce their own uh, scientific cultures, but then are colonized by the West. Uh, their science is uh, marginalized, if not uh, 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 thrown out, sort of ridiculed. And at the same time, uh, a lot of their science is appropriated uh, and uh, claimed to be part of Western science. Okay, so uh, colonization, theft, appropriation, all bad stuff. Okay, um, and then it talks about the rediscovery of what they call civil, civil uh, civilizational science. So here they'll point out what Islamic science, what Chinese science, and what Indian science brings to the table. Okay, and what they're showing is that, for example, here that science can be done in a, a non-aggressive way, a non-competitive way, a non-Western industrialized way. Um, and uh, yeah, and then it juxtaposes the two here, okay? So, um, and then here it looks more specifically into uh, racist aspects here, right? So, uh, the whole social Darwinism argument, which inevitably comes up in talking about the origin of species, this sort of um, talks about the whole eugenics ar argument, how eugenics, uh, you know, you know, comes out as scientific racism, how it's connected to scientific discourse, et cetera, et cetera. Again, if you are a, a proponent of science, a defender of science, you would say, well, this is an aberration or this is a misuse of science. But the philosophy of science argument is saying, no, this is not an aberration. This is part of the, this is part of the system of science. This is part of the nature of science, okay? So again, getting back to the idea of science as a other rising type mechanism, which can go uh, in some bad, pretty bad directions, okay? So myth of neutrality talks about here, okay? And then it, it'll go into um, the idea of multiculturalism and scientific knowledges. So here it's saying science can be done in a different way and not this Western, uh, modern Western way. Uh, indigenous cultures have a lot to say, a lot to add, okay. And then it'll go on uh, with the following thing here. So some good stuff here, which um, I would definitely recommend that you take a look at in uh, terms of understanding science and the discourse.